Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. Let me introduce myself. My name is Anggun Mukti Prima Bakti, and I'm from Universitas Sebelas Madu, Surakarta. In this second April 2021, I would like to present my research entitled The Role of Academic Self-Efficacy as a Predictor of Students' Arguments in English TV. Uh, in Indonesia, learning English as a foreign language, students mostly have major barriers they face while learning English, and one of the most major barriers learners have to deal with is public speaking anxiety. So the use of debate has been an effective way to strengthen student speaking and critical thinking. The aim of this study was to explore the academic self-efficacy predictor of participants' arguments in English debate. So using a theory by Bandura 1997 about academic self-efficacy. Why the researcher chose this topic is because there is still no research regarding academic self-efficacy in the debating context. So the previous study only uh, conducting a study about academic self-efficacy in English education in general or public speaking in general. So the methodology of this research, the research used a case study design to senior high school English debater students as the participants for the data collection, the researcher used questionnaire, semi-structured interview, and also observation. For the questionnaire, the researcher adapting the academic self-efficacy scale by Gavur and Ashraf 2006, and then for the semi-structured interview, it was conducted after spreading the questionnaire. So, uh, the question were made after uh, getting the result of the questionnaire. So, each student may, may, uh, may get different questions for the interview. And then for the observation, the researcher getting help uh, of a co-researcher to record the activity of the practice and competition of the English that will later on analyzed by the researcher. So here are the results, the results and the discussions of the research. So the questioner found that the academic self-efficacy of the students were in high category with the lowest score 101, the highest score 133, and then the mean score is 116 from the maximum score of 160. For the interview result, here are one of the examples that the researcher put in this slide, saying when presenting an argument, sometimes I feel doubtful after seeing my opponent present a good argument, meaning when the opponent giving a good argument, their self-efficacy will low. And then the next, but I'm so very confident in adding arguments when I master a topic I've mastered in previous regions, meaning that they pass experiences, making this, uh, they could pass experiences, making their self-efficacy were high in the previous competition. So the result of this study was in line with the result of a previous study conducted by Paradewari 2017, which found out that students are aware of the self-efficacy while doing public speaking and also have a higher self-efficacy in public speaking. In this context, the students were having a higher self-efficacy in the debating context. So the conclusion of my study was Students' academic self-efficacy was a predictor of their arguments in English debate. It is proved by uh, the result from the questionnaire, from the interview, and then also observation that mastery experiences, various experiences, social persuasion, and psychological and emotional states were affecting their arguments in English debate. The way they stated their arguments, the quality of their arguments, and also the way they present their arguments. So. Uh, that's all about my presentation today. Thank you so much for your attention. Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh.